dramatic and mesmerizing clouds like these over the Rupnarayan River, followed by intense rain, hot cups of coffee and you're on a vacation with your loving family. What else do you need to make your life perfect? This is Love You Zindagi for me. Hello everyone, welcome back to Shantini's Diary. Hope you all are doing good. So you know where I am. I am at Kolaghat at Shonar Bangla Hotel. In this video, I am going to give you a complete room tour of our room at Shonar Bangla Hotel and also a property tour. If you have not checked out how we arrived at Kolaghat, you can check out my previous video which I link right here. So the check-in time at Shonar Bangla Hotel is 1 pm. So those who have already watched my previous video, you know that we had our lunch and then checked in to the hotel. And as I mentioned earlier, if you are going directly to Shonar Bangla, you don't need to cross this bridge. It took us around one and a half hours to reach Shonar Bangla from Hawra Nabannu. We have arrived at Kolaghat Shonar Bangla Hotel and we enjoyed the long drive. We'll just quickly park the car, do our check-in formalities and then I'll take you to my room. We are done with our check-in formalities and we got room at the top floor. Basically, we had booked the room at the top floor and it is a premium room. I'll definitely tell you the price that we are paying for this room. But first, let's go and check out our room. This is a beautiful long corridor and this will lead you to your rooms. The corridor is super windy because it is open on both the sides. The corridor also has CCTV cameras so you don't need to worry about that. From the right end of the corridor you can see the reception below. So that is the reception. Now let's go to our room. So this is our room 417. It is at the top floor and it is a premium room. All rooms here are river facing but the higher you stay you get a better view and hence you pay a higher price. So just as you enter it's a huge room and on the right hand side you have a huge bathroom. I am saying huge because usually in hotels the washroom are very small and the room is also a smaller size. These are the toiletries so I'll show you later what they have given us. The washroom was very clean and dry and it also had geyser. They had given us two towels but that was placed on the bed. So after the washroom this is a full size mirror and you have a double bed, two side tables, a couch where you can just sit and relax, two glasses, one center table. They gave two bottles of mineral water complimentary. That's the mini fridge, TV and you have kettle, coffee, tea, cups and this is the wardrobe. Now coming to the view for which we are paying this price. It's a huge balcony with the awesome mesmerizing view. Just look at the view and the length of the balcony. It's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I've been to so many places in India and outside India. I've rarely seen hotel rooms and balconies so big. I think only in Mauritius we had such big room and a balcony like this. I am super happy with the room and the balcony. Now I showed you in the washroom that they had given toiletries. So there was comb, two soaps, shower gel, conditioner, body wash and dental kit. So the plan for now is since we have already had our lunch I'll just feed my daughter and then we'll go directly to the pool and enjoy. I'm carrying her lunch but for the rest of the meals I'm carrying her electric cooker where I'll cook and serve her fresh meal. So we are at the pool now and look how my daughter is enjoying. This is the first time she's in the pool and I didn't expect that she'd be enjoying so much. We'll spend some time here and then I'll catch up with you again. We had spent almost 45 minutes at the pool and my daughter and my husband are sleeping now and I'm enjoying nature.
It was raining till late afternoon. But did that spoil our plan and the stay? Not at all. This resort takes care of that as well. It has well equipped games room for adults and kids. So while it was raining cats and dogs outside, my daughter was playing at the kids room and I was enjoying myself at the adult games room. This is the kids playroom and it was very well equipped with all the games that we usually get in a play school. My daughter thoroughly enjoyed and it was really difficult for us to get her out of there. So while my daughter is enjoying herself at the kids room, I'll quickly give you a property tour which I had promised. So I'm just outside the kids playroom and the adults game room and I'm walking down the corridor and I'll reach the reception area. The resort was absolutely full this weekend but I think most of the weekends this resort is full. And especially in the rainy season when the Rupnarayan river has a lot of water, it is absolutely beautiful and mesmerizing. This hotel also provides a well-equipped gym and a spa. So if you are a fitness freak and don't want to miss your fitness regime even on a vacation, don't worry, you are covered. This beautiful building is the reception area and they have a huge parking lot. This is a temple of Lord Shiva and there is ample car parking space so you don't worry about that. And now I am walking towards their lawn. They also have 2-3 lawns, very well maintained and manicured. I am walking down now towards the riverside. It's around 6 pm and look how beautiful it looks. It's a full moon night today and it is absolutely dark outside. This is Rup Narayan river and the full moon. It's absolutely beautiful and serene. We already had our dinner. The food was average but the price was on the higher side. Tomorrow morning I'll show you the pool side and also tell you the tariff that we are paying and also the food prices. So good night for now while we enjoy serenity with nature, full moon and Rup Narayan. Good morning from Kolaghat, Shonar Bangla Hotel and this is what I woke up to. It's around 7 am in the morning and we are up and ready to dive into the pool. The breakfast here is complimentary and the breakfast time is from 8.30 am to 10 am and it is a buffet breakfast but we planned before going for breakfast, we'll dive into the pool and enjoy there for some time and then go for breakfast, get ready and check out. The pool timings are from 8 am to 8 pm. So here is the pool site. It is an infinity pool. It is very well maintained and right now it's 8 am and there is nobody else in the pool except us. So we are enjoying at the fullest. 
Yesterday afternoon, after checking in when we were enjoying at the pool and swimming, there were a lot of people. So I did not shoot anything because many people won't like intruding into their privacy. So I avoid shooting. But now, since only we are there, so I am showing you the pool side. This is very beautiful. Wearing swimsuit is absolutely compulsory. Otherwise, you will be fined. Also, I told you that I'll show you the price of the food. So this is the menu card. You will get almost anything you want, but the price is on the higher side. And personally, for me, I did not like the quality of the food. It was average. And I did not like it because the price that I was paying for and the food that I was getting was not matching. At the price that I was paying, I was expecting a better quality food. Also, Kolagat is not a remote area that you can expect higher price of food at a lower quality. You can pause and check out the price of all the food items. You can order infant food here. And they also have a list of infant food that they can provide and the price. For me, wherever I travel, I prefer to carry Prestige electric cooker, which is of 1 litre for my daughter. And there I cook her khichdi, rice, dal, suji and basically whatever she eats. But there are many people I know who prefer to take infant food from the hotel itself. So you can check out the price here and then order accordingly. The breakfast was a buffet spread. They had quite a few items but the quality of the food and taste was average. So here's a glimpse of what we had for the breakfast. There was idli, uttapam, pav bhaji, vara, boiled egg, bread, sandwich, oats, cheesy potato wedges, seveya for dessert. Luchi, poha, tea, coffee, lassi, but here also all the food items tasted average. And now finally coming to our experience and the price that we paid. The price that we paid for the premium room which included complimentary breakfast was 5500. Our experience of staying at this hotel was pretty good. The staffs are very courteous and whenever we requested for water refill or tea and coffee refill, they did so and I would highly recommend if you want a quick getaway that is near Kolkata yet refreshing then this can be your next destination. It's finally time to say goodbye to Kolaghat and to Rupnarayan river. I thoroughly enjoyed this day. I hope you enjoyed this video and found this video informative. If you have do hit the like button and subscribe to my channel Shantini's Diary. If you have any queries you can comment in the comment box below and I am always happy to answer to all your queries. And until we meet again, do take care and bye bye.